Push the folds. This is Vitaly Tolokonikov. He picks up a 6-7 offsuit. It looks like he's going to get involved here. You know, one of the things I've noticed about a lot of the Russian players, sort of a theme, is that they really mix it up well. You know, they play conservatively, but every once in a while they just say, okay, I'm going to make a move. It's really difficult to play against players who randomize like that. And uh, another one you're looking at right here, Likov, has done that rather well. He's in the big blind, and I don't think he's going to surrender it with King Nine of Clubs. No, he's going to want to see a flop with this hand. You know, he, he could potentially re-raise, but it's, it is a suited hand. You know, one of the things that you worry about when you play King-9 is when it comes 10-jack-queen, you've got the king I straight, but you have to worry about the ace-king. It's not a threat here. He's up against 6-7 offsuit, but it often is, and it's a dangerous hand to play. Okay, well, this is a board that no players hit, so really it comes down to who wants it more. The most aggressive player is going to win this pot. Likov checks on over to Tolokonikov, who bets with the 6-7. You think he has to, pretty much. It's the only way he can win the pot. And now Likov just kind of glance over him. Have a look, see if he thinks he's got anything. And he, you know, he's making the call here with king high. This is pretty good. Pretty good read so far on the hand. Turn of three. Doesn't change too much. Vitaly now with a gut shot straight draw. Get you five. Of course, a six or a seven. Well, Lee Cole win the pot. has checked him again. And I look. I think Vitaly's going to bet again. Well, see, very, this is some really good poker here. Uh, he's, he's firing the second bullet at it. The question is, will Likov make a call once again with just king high? You know, this is a tough spot to make a call. If the guy does have an ace, I mean, you're drawing completely dead. If he has a four, of course you're dead. But will Likov read through this second bullet from Tolokonikov? He's thinking about it. What amazing play here. He's just absolutely calling him down with king high. King nine high. Tolokonikov is probably going to think to himself, i got to give up now, don't I? Well, the river's a blank. Likov has checked again. Is he going to fire a third and final time? Is he going to try and steal it on the river? Well, obviously we know the only way he can win the pot here is with a bet. The question is, will it even work? <coughs> We've seen Likov make an amazing call on the flop, a better call on the turn. You know, he might be dialed in. He may have some sort of physical tell. They've played a lot of poker against each other throughout the tournament. Just may have a dead read on him and is letting him bluff his chips off. And it looks like he's going for it. Vitaly is counting out those chips. Well, the pot over 250,000 already. What's he going to leave it? 160,000. And this is a tough decision for well, Likov. This is, some, this is fun. I'm really enjoying this hand. You're seeing two players play at a really, really high level. Both players know, you know, you've got nothing, but so do you. You've got nothing, too. The question is, whose nothing is better? Likov obviously does have the best hand with King High, but it would be a very difficult call to call the bet on the flop, another one on the turn, and then on the river. But he really, really is suspicious here with King High. Something in his gut is telling him, I don't know, this guy's just got nothing. Could be the call of the tournament if he's able to make it. Unbelievable. He's made the call. A terrific call on the flop. A terrific call on the turn. And he calls on the river with just king high. Well, that is the hand of the I, tournament. I'm, I'm speechless, to be honest with you. This is amazing. Both players really just played the hand well. Tolokonikov pushed three times. What are you supposed to do? You figure the guy's got nothing. You're right. And he still calls you with king high. Unbelievable read there. That's a boost of confidence for sure for Likov right now. No one's going to want to bluff that guy after that putt. <laughs> Incredible stuff.